Congratulations to the Houston Chamber Choir for the Grammy win. Wow, awarded best choral cool performance last Sunday. And we have with us today director Bob Simpson here with us along with singer Wayne Ashley, fresh back from their travels to Los Angeles. And the envelope, please. The envelope is right here. <laughs> <laughs> the grand winners, congratulations. And that's the official one that said you. This is it. The Grammy. This is it. Yes. Give us a little Amazing. peek at that. That's a big deal. How exciting was this moment for you all? There it, was, it is. There it is. There it is. And this confused me a little bit because the nominees were named by the conductors. And I was oh. listening for Robert Simpson and I heard Duraflay and I stood frozen for a moment and didn't realize what had happened until <laughs> my wife just said, she we, we won, won. we won. <laughs> we won. Yes. It was utter chaos because we just didn't realize what was going on. Now, how many of you all got to go? Uh, it was myself, uh, Bob and Mariana, uh, another singer of ours, Jack Byram and his uh, partner or his girlfriend uh, and we all were able to uh, be there at the ceremony. Explain but that it, moment yeah. for you. It was it was surreal uh, from having grown up and watching these things for so long uh, and then to finally like actually just even to be in the room you know it, it, forget winning but just to be at the ceremony as they're calling out Grammys and seeing people go up to the stage was incredible. It was surreal and being just a few feet away from them. And then they call our name and we're like, wait, no, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was unbelievable. Now, when you think in terms of Grammy Awards, there are a lot of choral groups competing. How many did you compete against, and did you really think that someone else was going to take that first spot? <laughs> well, the first round, there were 158 choirs who were nominated. Wowzers. And so to get to the final category, they shrank that down to five. Mm -hmm. And any one of the five could have won. We went thinking we were the first only group that had just received the, the first nominee. Others um, had been nominated before, and so we thought maybe we would have another chance another year. But it turned out that we... Uh, we're one for one. Well, we couldn't be more <laughs> proud of you. And you'll get the big hardware. That statue will be shipped to you in about six weeks, I understand. Exactly. Now, let's talk about when people in the Houston area can hear you. Where do you perform? And, and how do we get to know you better? Because, you I mean, what talent you have. Well, yes, this is our 24th season. So we have been at this for a long time. And this Grammy is just the culmination of uh -huh. so much hard work. We're a professional ensemble. All of our singers have gone to conservatories and schools of music to train to be singers. Uh, our next performance is coming up on February 22nd and 23rd, and it's going to be a piece called Circle Song by an, a, an English composer, Bob Chilcott, and it's Native American texts, and that will be done at South Main Baptist Church on Saturday and Sunday. Well, good oh, to yes, know. Yes. Well, congrats yes. to you both. We're so yeah. happy, and to the entire choir. And when you Thank get you. the hardware, we want you back. Yeah, Thank there you, you. We'll go. be back. <laughs> we want to take a look at it. All right, take yeah. care of yourself. Thank you so much. Hey,